guys. How's everyone doing? Uh, I'm going to use a mic stand. I've been memorizing this one. Ready? Check. So, uh, this poem is about um, what uh, WikiLeaks and Bradley Manning were known for. Basically, like uh, uncovering the fact that like American soldiers were slaughtering uh, innocent Iraqis, uh, and among them journalists. And I'm a journalist major, so it kind of like touched their nerve. <clears throat> and the other fact is like a majority of the soldiers that are in the American Army, the Navy, the uh, the military, uh, happen to be people of color. Yeah. So it's uh, sadly ironic and historically poetic that the rich are hiring poor people of color who kill other poor people of color. Yeah. So the poem's called The American Soldier. As the American soldier locks his sight on Iraqi journalists in New Baghdad thought to have AK-47s, does he know that the oil used to keep his gun greased is silicone based? Does the soldier know that silicone is made of tiny beads like sand? Does he know that? That the same desert sand floor that absorbs the Iraqi journalist's spilled blood is one and the same as the oil that he uses to caress, to maintain, to hug, and handle the Apache's mounted machine gun, breathing in slowly and pulling the trigger softly, while exhaling, feeling the percussion, the automatic shots reverberating throughout the metal body of the Apache, through his arms, through his chest. As the American soldier that is of Mexican descent, with light brown skin and dark brown hair and eyes, blocks his sight on Iraqi journalists thought to be armed with RPGs in New Baghdad, who share, uh, who share his same identifying characteristics. Does he think about Iraqi families celebrating birthdays with grilled, heavily marinated meat and beer, the kids playing soccer while brothers fight over politics, the music of culture loudly played for the entire block to hear, neighbors wanting or not. As the American soldier is used as an instrument of destruction, of racism, occupation, and imperialism, does he think about going back home where his family is being persecuted for having accents in Arizona, a last name that ends with Ez? But he doesn't think about that. He doesn't think about the sand and the gun oil and the tiny beads that make up the oil, that the innocent man he looks down upon and slays in New Baghdad resembles his uncle, his cousin, his father, himself. But he does not know that. That borders, race, country, the sense of detachment, religion, pride, hate, however patriotic, is a myth. So that the American soldier can make the correlation. So that he sees the oneness, the impact that he has, and the impact that the world has had upon him. Not a single moment should pass with silence. Peace should be illegal. Not a single American flag should fly upright. Not a single military recruitment center should remain standing. Thank you. Yeah.